man, check this out. He hadn't started this truck in a long time. What a truck. Oh, it's all been taken away. Yeah. I I need you to <laughs> Oh boy. I've just got to I used to try to fix them and do things to them, but I've got to order them. This transmission stuff has been so busy. It's a long bed step side. He hadn't started this. I don't know if you heard him in two or three weeks. Started right up. Six cylinder. Custom Deluxe. I think it's a 78 model. And he said he don't have to worry about taking the keys out because it's a three speed on the column and nobody knows how to drive a three speed on the column anymore. What's happened to people? Check out this four wheel drive truck here. This is a neat old truck, 73. That's a 74. 74, I'm sorry. I like that color right there. That's a cool old truck. Boy, what a neat looking truck. Like that steering wheel too, four bar. Four speed. He's drove this truck in the snow and everything. In the blizzard of 93. This is what he drove. Never got stuck. Man, what a neat looking old truck. This is really cool. Rust, yeah, it's got rust, but it's a 73. I mean, they're, this, the round headlights were kind of prone to rusting. And this is an old truck. This is a neat old truck right here. I like this. It sure isn't like left turn bill, is it? He just showed it the key and this six cylinder started up. Left turn bill needs a carburetor so bad. Still got the jack and everything in it. Let's go and look at this one over here real quick. My buddy has these trucks and he said he used to be a Ford guy, his whole family go Fords, but he said he bought a Chevrolet truck one time and he's been Chevrolet ever since. Said if he had to drive a Ford, he'd just walk. <laughs> 292 six cylinder in it. I, I haven't seen these before, so this is my first time as well. Scottsdale. I don't know if you can see inside or not. I'm not going to open the door because I didn't ask permission. But it's a long bed truck. Those 292 six cylinders are pretty, pretty popular six cylinders. They're really tough. Good. Maybe you can see a little bit better here on the inside if I hold my. Well, I can't. <laughs> trying to hold my hand where you can see I don't know if I'm doing any good maybe that's better it's got a pretty good dash for sitting for as long as it has but he's really big into Chevy's this might be a 78 I'm not sure but like I said, I didn't ask permission to open anything. And I'm kind of trying to be respectful of people's property. A couple of more square bodies down here. Long bed trucks looks like. Anyway, I thought you might get a kick out of looking at some of these old square body trucks. I appreciate you watching.
<laughs> Morning. <laughs> anyway, I won't walk down any further because I don't want to get on somebody's nerves. But appreciate you watching a little video. Hope you hope you enjoyed it. If, uh, if I had any more to it, I'll get back with you. If not, you're watching Primitive's Best. I appreciate it. I'm either going to put this on Primitive's Best or Man on a Budget. Probably Primitive's Best. Y'all have a great day. God bless y'all. Don't forget I have a second YouTube channel. I just mentioned Man on a Budget. And I'm on a Facebook Primitive's Best and a Instagram Primitive's Best and Instagram Man on a Budget 1. Y'all have a great day. Good morning. <laughs> Can you hear the rooster? Y'all have a blessed day today. See you later. Guys, I got permission to do a quick video on this truck. Uh, I was pointing out the hubcaps to my friend and here. Ain't this a neat old truck? I'd love to have those hubcaps. Little dog dish hubcaps with the beauty rings. Ain't that cool? Tip column, AC truck. I don't know if you can see all that or not. Power windows. This is Cheyenne. I think it is Cheyenne. I can't really read it. Well, it says Scottsdale. Man, I'd love to have that grill too. That's a good looking grill. A lot of good parts on this truck. A lot of good parts. Ain't those hubcaps neat though? Hard to find the little dog dish hubcaps. A cargo light, door edge guard, window. Uh, I can't think of the name. I always get mixed up when I get excited. Golly, I like to have this. Anyway. Mrs. P.I.B.'s up there looking at this parts truck and she's fell in love with it with so many parts for it that we could use, but we'll just see what happens. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. Catch you in the next one or next episode I've been saying lately. <laughs> see y'all later.